Hi everybody, how are we? So guys, as you can probably tell, I'm still on my phone. So annoying. I'm bringing my camera in today. Hopefully they can sort it for me. Um, oh, it's just one thing after the other, as you'll have probably seen in my last video, but there's gonna be no negativity to day it's fine it'll get sorry it's just a camera it's not like i can't make my videos on here so it's totally okay so guys for today's video i am basically going to spend a whole 24 hours doing things by myself connor has gone back to ireland for like 10 days or something and um, something like that and so i'm home alone i am kneeling down on the floor because i have obviously nothing to stand my camera on Plus it's like morning and I'm just not arse fiddle around with it. So I was just like, I have it propped up against the flower pot. And I was just like, oh, I'll just get level with it. It's fine. So yeah, 24 hours on my own. I don't think I'll be, like, I'm actually quite busy today. Obviously I'm working until this afternoon and then I'm going to go um, to bring my camera in. And then I might have like a little wander around, see something or see like if I can find a new pair of jeans. I really want like a black pair of jeans, but like a washed out black, if you know what I mean. I might go have a look for the pair of them. Um, and then <laughs> tonight I'm, I have booked to go and see Uncharted with Tom Holland in it by myself. I, Joe was like, no, you can't do that. And I was like, my mom used to go to the cinema on her own all the time and she used to have a great time. Like, but if you think about it, you don't talk to anybody in the cinema anyways. I booked the seat right, like, like, so the rows are like this and then you have like the aisle. I booked the very last seat on this aisle because I pee a lot so I can just, yeah, I'm kind of, I'm actually kind of excited to spend the day by myself. Um, I'm gonna make breakfast now. I'm making pancakes. I so I make my pancakes out of like porridge oats and I like add porridge oats, two eggs, a banana, and some soy milk, and I like whisk it all together until it makes like a batter, and then I just put them on the thingy. And I've been craving them since Tuesday. So I'm gonna make them now. Cool. <laughs> accidentally burnt this part but like it's okay number two is coming and it's not gonna be burnt i promise ta-da they don't look very cute but they taste really yummy i'm gonna be really bold and put nutella on them though so if anybody's been watching like most of my previous videos and um, you'll know that i'm trying to like lose weight and tone up and i know you're probably thinking now like you're having nutella pancakes for your breakfast all and um, these pancakes all together are 536 calories it's 12 o'clock, so this is like my breakfast lunch. Um, I'm trying to stay under 1,500. So, like, I'm kind of doing okay. And I know you're saying the Nutella's bad, but I'm, my period's due. I'm going to eat the Nutella, do you know what I mean? It's okay to not be so strict every single day as long as you have some sort of balance. I am going to the gym on my lunch break as well. So this will fuel me through it. And I don't really feel bad because these are going to slap. Look at those bad boys. Hey guys, so fun little change of plan. I'm going to go on a sunbed instead of going to bring my camera in. Oh, I just won't get back to home and it's just gonna annoy me, so I'll just wait. But um, yeah, I'm gonna go on a sunbed. I don't know what video it was, but if you've been following me since like I started, I don't even, yeah, I don't remember what video it is, but I went to a sunbed close to here and it was so shite. So like, like you can only do four minutes at a go. So it was like four minutes or eight minutes, 12 minutes, whatever. And I was like, oh, that's a bit, that's a bit dangerous now. Anyways, so I went in and I was like, it was still summer. Like I, I moved in May, so it was sunny and warm. So I was like, okay, no, I'll just start on a four. And I swear to God, I was whiter coming out than I was going in. 
I sorry, I hate filming on my phone. It's so annoying. Hold on, let me. Okay, so it was yeah, it was definitely whiter coming out than it was going in. Like it was so bad. So I was like, well, maybe like I'm just too tanned for four minutes now. So then I went in and I was like, shit, I'm gonna have to sit on it for eight. And then I was like, God, I hope I don't get burnt to a crisp. I did not change colour whatsoever. And if you go on sunbeds, you'll know like eight minutes is a very long time for a sunbed. By the way, I'm not promoting a sunbed because I know it's not meant to be very good for you. But personally, it works for me. I like it. It's my own preference, but I'm not telling anybody that's watching this to go on one. Um, so didn't go back to that place, but obviously I need to start my sunbeds now, in my opinion, for holidays. So yeah, we're going to test a new one. And then I'm going to go straight to the gym from the sunbed like i have all my gym gear on i'm gonna bring my water in my handbag <sighs> we're gonna push out another sydney session the girl is 22 weeks pregnant or something and she is like killing it but let's go i'm actually kind of excited the rain has also stopped so i'm hoping it holds off just so i get to the dupe yay gorgeous gorgeous girls love a tan bed it's a book here and i'm saying i didn't book and i don't have an account so i have to wait i'm stressed out this is the fanciest tan bed I've ever been on. This is so cute. It was honestly like the fanciest tanning salon, salon, tanning salon that I've ever been on. Um, that I've ever been in. Now I have to figure out how I get home. Yeah. Woohoo! Gym done. Some bed done. Being on my own is really not that bad. <laughs> I'm gonna make some chicken and rice now just for like my dinner I don't know if this vlog is really boring or not and I'm not really gonna know until I put it all together but I obviously I'm just gonna have something small like chicken and rice like I said because obviously I'm gonna get popcorn at the cinema so yeah I'm do that gonna have a shower and then we can go have a look around in Shepherd depending on the time I'm excited and scared but I do think that I booked not the wrong seat but like the seat that I wanted I don't think that I booked it properly so the ones the last time me and Joe went to the cinema I was on the very edge but it was a different cinema so I don't know if this layout is actually the same so I could be like trapped in the corner and if I have to pee I'm gonna have to hold it because I'm not asking everybody to go love that okay so all washed hair washed I don't know what to wear, you know, because like I want to be comfy, but I don't want to look like a like like track. Not that saying it does, but do you know what I mean. Like the only deep, like the only decent track I have is a Fila one, and it's grey. <laughs> hmm. Might just stick a pair of leggings on and a hoodie. Hey. Okay, so this is like the world's most boring outfit that I literally always wear, but. It's comfy, bobbed. My hair is actually drowned in and all fuzzy woody, but I'm actually excited. I think. Ooh, I'm getting nervous as well. I feel like a loser. I'm officially scared of being on my own. Ooh. I really hope I didn't fuck up my seat because I will have to pee. made through the whole film all by myself obviously duh, that's so dramatic but i won't lie this the social anxiety like going up i was like oh god and then i was in line for ages to get popcorn and a drink and i was like oh like i had no one to talk to i was just talking to myself in my head and i was like oh it's fine like people go to the cinema on their own all the time like it's fine it's fine it's fine and then i got in there and i i did book the seat wrong so I wanted like the aisle seat, but I got the very corner seat, but I didn't actually have to pee that bad and the film wasn't that long, but it was so good. Honestly, if you haven't seen it, I would so recommend it. Um, JJ from Outer Banks is in it. Didn't know that. I didn't even watch the trailer, so I don't even know if he's in the trailer. Um, but yeah, Tom Holland was Tom Holland. Good as always. But yeah, lads, I did it. I spent the entire day doing stuff by myself. That might, seem not, that might not seem like a big achievement to like some people, but like I always 
usually have Connor or like Joe or someone with me. So I'm proud of myself. I texted my mom and I was like, I was listening to my boy myself. And she was like, why? <laughs> I was like, girl, you used to do it the whole time. Don't come for me. But yeah, it's like 10 o'clock now. It's going to be watch a bit of telly and go to bed. I was going to do my tan because we're going to a gig tomorrow. But I actually, fair, can't be arsed. And I have found an outfit that I don't have to tan for. So winner, winner, chicken dinner. I'm stuffed. Speaking of chicken dinners. Ate my body weight and popcorn. But yeah, I had I actually had a really good time. And if you ever... Don't let anything stop you from doing stuff on your own. Like, if you want to do something and so you have no one to go with, just go do it. Obviously, if it's like bowling or something, don't do that. But like, if you want to go see a film and no one else does, go. It's totally fine. I really did think it was going to be a lot... Like, worse than it was. But I had a great time. I would really recommend it. Maybe, Connor, if you're watching this, just don't come back. Look at me. I'm Miss Independent. Miss Independent. But yeah, that's the end of my vlog, guys. I don't know if it was actually any good or if it was just literally a lot of shite pushed together. Let me know in the comments if you hate it or not. And um, please, also, if you're watching this, if you haven't subscribed to my channel, please do. I want to get to 200 before we go to America. Help a girl live her dream. Okay, I'll stop singing now. Thanks, guys. Bye.